What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, if you ring the little bell by my soul tribe, I super appreciate it. If you enjoy my content, you guys, and you enjoy my gabby mouth, you can ring the bell. Just saying. Um, this is um, week week three reading for Sun and Sides. This resonates the outside to any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Warp, Node, Midhaven, Jupiter. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Um, personal readings are currently open right now. I have a few slots left. If you'd like to book one, it's $100 for 15 minutes. The description's in the, um, uh, my, excuse me, my phone number's in the description box below. You can text me if you would like. Okay, so I got a channeled in as I was meditating. I actually got two channeled in as I was meditating on your week three's energy side. And the first one I heard, um, com complete chaos is about to break out. And then it was about 45 seconds after that, I heard some at a funeral, some um, over a medication um, room incident. So you plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you. Complete chaos is about to break out. Some, some of you guys, now it doesn't have to be you that's directly involved in this. I just want to say, um, you have to take the messages that resonate and leave what doesn't. There's millions of billions, billions of people in the world. Um, but it sounds like whether you're directly or indirectly involved in this, there's some kind of complete chaos about to break out. Um, some at a funeral soon. So you could be at the funeral or not at the funeral. Maybe you're going to hear about the funeral. Maybe you're at the funeral. Maybe you're the director at the funeral, like the funeral director. I don't know. But some kind of complete chaos about to break out at a funeral. Whether you're a family member, or a funeral director, you're hearing about it from somebody at this funeral. Um, or, and some kind of medication room incident. So you could be the person directly involved in this medication room incident or somebody indirectly involved in this medication room incident or someone hearing about this medication room incident or someone that has to fire somebody involved in the medication room incident. Because a medication room incident, that's that's serious. I mean, that's all I heard was medication room incident, but it had to have been something serious for serious and complete chaos is about to break out I'm, i mean i'm serious so it's something huge um i'm thinking terminations are probably going to get involved in that i didn't hear that part that's just my deductive reasoning and logic but it's enough to cause complete chaos and any kind of term um uh, medication room incident is complete chaos i'm just saying for real for, well it can be it can be depending on how you handle it whoever this is i don't think they're handling it right i'm not saying it's you but it's somebody. So you plug it in how it resonates. For some, it could be you. For some, it could be somebody you're connected to. But you plug it in how it resonates. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Three of Cups reversed. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Oh, my Lord. Sag. Holy crap. You've got eight of pentacles reversed and ten of pentacles reversed. Oh, my God. Hold on. Let me see if I hear anything. A Pisces is about to drag a Sagittarius into a very, very, very serious situation soon. Medication room incident. It would be very smart, Sagittarius, to cover your ass and let this Pisces handle their own. Because they are a huge manipulator and you don't even know the half of it. Oh my God, you plug it in how it resonates. Oh my God. Oh, you plug it in how it resonates. So, Sag, it sounds like you, um, you're you involved with this Pisces and this medication room incident. Now, I will tell you, you have to be a nurse. You have to be a nurse because CNAs are not allowed. Well, somebody told me, excuse me, somebody told me on the comments that they work somewhere. Oh, assisted living, where they were. But um, this is a medication room, though. 
medication rooms you're not a lot like it has to be nurses only assisted living i think is a little different i think it's a little different um if i'm not mistaken but i've worked in skilled nursing slash long-term care and i've worked in hospital you cannot allow cnas are not allowed in there period period um, only nurses. So I'm thinking you're a nurse, Sag, if this resonates with you, or you're connected to, uh, connected to this Pisces in some shape, form, or fashion, and they are a nurse, however that resonates. And I'm serious about that. Um, wow. But um, if this resonates with you, they're about to pull you into this, this medication room incident. Whether you were in the medication room with this uh, Pisces, because this Pisces has to be a nurse, LPN, LVN, or RN, however that resonates, in the medication room. So you either work with them, or I think you work with them for some. For some, you could just be a family member having to hear about this crazy crap. For some, you could have been a coworker not involved in the medication room incident, but somehow they're trying to pull you in it. For some, you could be a friend. They're trying to call, trying to pull you into the drama. I don't know, but um, they're trying to pull you into it in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, and they're involved in this medication room incident. But I heard it would be very, very smart for you to basically separate yourself from it um, because you don't even know the half of it. So they're not, this Pisces is not telling you the truth um, or the whole truth. Not by a long shot, but it's going to come out whether this Pisces wants it to or not. Oh, my God. Oh, this is so strong. I heard not by a long shot. They're not telling the truth by a long shot, Sag. So whoever you are, you could be their supervisor. I'm feeling for some, you could be their manager, boss, supervisor, or something of that nature. For some, you could be a family member they're trying to snow over. For some, you could be a friend they're trying to snow over. But... I feel for at least one of you sides you are their boss, like manager, boss, or supervisor. And I'm serious. But um, however that resonates, though, they're not, I heard they're not telling the truth, not by a long shot. So they're covering something up in a huge way. But I heard it's about to come out, whether they want it to come out or not, basically. The woo wee Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's going to be so bad, the board is going to get involved. Know this. Oh, my God. Whoa. This is so strong. And last night, I had the, a freaking med room incident, uh, med room bust come up in my reading. I heard it's about to get so bad, the board is about to get involved. Now, this is nursing. This is nurses in a med room. So I'm thinking board of nursing. I did not hear board of nursing in here. I just heard board. So I think board of nursing. It has to be. It would have to be. Because they're in a medication room with a med incident. CNAs are not allowed in there. It have to be a nurse and a board getting involved. Well, y'all know I'm a nurse. So board of nursing. It would have to be the board of nursing getting involved. I heard it's going to be so bad the board's going to get involved. So I think the board of nursing. Oh, my God. And I heard it be smart to not get involved, to let the Pisces handle their own, on their own, so their own, handle their own business, take accountability for their own actions, basically. That's what I'm feeling from this. So, and I say that because the energy in the Tarot is <clears throat> Eight of Pentacles reversed, Three of Cups reversed, Ten of Pentacles reversed. Money loss, money loss, money loss, money loss. Lawsuits are coming from this on many angles. Know this. Separating from this Pisces is your best bet for sure. Oh, my God. I heard um, lawsuits are coming in this in many angles. So, many lawsuits are coming. I guess the company... Uh, I'm assuming the company, um, because last night's reading, I heard corporate was going to get involved with that med room incident. So if it's the same med room incident, corporate was going to get involved and bust these assholes because somebody in the facility in that med room, in that reading, was trying to cover somebody's ass, basically. They were trying to cover, cover, cover some shit up in the med room, but corporate's about to get involved with the cameras in the med room. And it's, um, I think, 
the company is one of the lawsuits is what I'm trying to say. Companies won the lawsuits. The Board of Nursing might be another lawsuit. And I'm just serious about that. I heard many lawsuits in many aspects. So I'm feeling it might be Board of Nursing, possibly. It might be the company. It might be a patient. Maybe they're taking some of the patient's medicine, possibly. It might be a coworker. But many lawsuits on many aspects. So it would be smart for you, Sag, whoever you are, whether you're their boss, manager, supervisor, CEO, family member, a friend, yazzy, 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 to separate yourself because this is a hot mess express. It is about to go up in flames. Know this. Oh my God. I heard it's about to go up in flames. Know this. And that could be the complete chaos energy too. Money lost all over the place. I think this place is about to get fired. And I and I, I think you might get fired if you cover your cover this Pisces ass. Because I heard it would be smart for you to separate. And the energy here, I'm feeling, could be the Pisces energy here. But if you do not separate yourself, I think this might be your, uh, your energy. Because this is somebody's energy. This is your reading. Usually it would be Sag's energy. But I heard the spirit message in here to separate yourself from this person. So I'm thinking if you make the choice to separate yourself from this person and tell corporate, because our corporate was going to get involved. I think it's the same incident that's piggybacking, but you have to plug your life out resonates. If you tell corporate everything that happened that you know happened, because something crazy is about to happen in Medroom or has just happened, how that resonates, involving a Pisces, a newly hired Pisces, by the way. Obviously it has to be a nurse, but... However that resonates, um, usually this is your energy is what I'm saying. But I heard it would be smart for you to separate from the Pisces. So I'm thinking this is definitely the Pisces energy, Piscean energy, because they're going to get fired according to last night's message and today in your reading, Sag. Eight of Pentacles reversed, Ten of Pentacles reversed, Three of Cups reversed, no celebration, money loss, huge ass money loss, huge money loss. Huge ass money loss. No celebration because there's a huge ass money loss because they're going to be about to get fired. For some, they could be under contract. But the thing is, is if you're under contract in nursing and you have a huge med room error and you try to cover it up, that's automatic firing. That's automatic termination for anybody who doesn't know that. I don't care if you're under contract or not. That's breach of contract. That is automatic termination. Just to let everybody know. So, Sag... I think this would be you if you're the manager, boss, or supervisor, or CEO, and you cover up for this crap because corporate's going to find out anyways. So this might be your energy if you decide to cover this Pisces ass. So I would be very, very, very careful. Very careful. Of course, everybody has free will and you can make the choices you want, but this eight of pinnacles reverse, 10 of pinnacles reverse, huge ass money loss, huge ass money loss, no celebration. Just saying, just saying. It's going down the daggum drain. And that med room incident is about to be very, very, very important and integral. Spirit messages you have some, Sag. A Sag is about to get a huge wake-up call. Okay, I heard a Sag is about to get a huge wake-up call. I'm serious. A Torn is about to become very, 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 very angry at a Pisces soon. Very angry. Know this. And you will see it soon. Okay, I heard a Taurus is about to get very, very angry at a Pisces soon. Very angry. And you will see it soon. So, um, I'm feeling it could be that. Um, it could be a Taurus in the med room incident. Because this med room incident is pulling up like nobody's business. Or it could be somebody in your personal life, your professional life, a neighbor, etc., 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 but we've got Piscean energy, very, very strong in your reading, and a Tauren. So it, you have to plug them in wherever they fit in your life if they do fit. For some, it could be the workplace, med room incident. For some, it could be another workplace situation. For some, it could be neighbors, friends, coworker, family, yazzy, yazzy, yazzy. But I heard a um, Taurus is about to get very, very angry at a Pisces soon. You're about to see this. So you, Sag, is about to see, you, Sag, you're about to see this Taurus about to get very, very angry at this Pisces. Um, and that could be the con the chaos breaking out too. However, that resonates in your life. Wow. 
Nine of Cups reversed, Three of Pentacles upright. Someone's about to get sent to rehab, whether they want to be sent to rehab or not. It will be forced. And they're not going to like it. Oh my God. Woo! You plug it in how it resonates. Heard someone's about to get uh, sent to rehab, whether they want to be sent to rehab or not. They will be forced, whether they want to or not. So I'm thinking for some of you guys, it is this med room. I think somebody was taking somebody, um, take medicine in med room. So that's what I think. And that's an automatic termination for anybody who doesn't know. Uh, healthcare professionals, if you're not a healthcare professional, if you, I don't care if you're under contract or not. If you ingest any kind of medicine in a workplace situation and your ass gets caught, it's an automatic termination. I don't care if you're under contract or not. If you steal medicine, it's an automatic termination. I don't care if you're under contract or not. For anybody that needs to know, um, know that, um, I'm just letting y'all know. I mean, that's serious. And I say that because I've worked in the healthcare profession for a long time, a long time. But whoever this is, I heard they're about to get sent to um, rehab, whether they want to get sent to rehab or not, that will be forced. So I think for some of these situations, it is this med room incident that keeps pulling up in my readings and pulling up in my readings. And I've done like five or six sign readings already before this. Sagittarius is very important with this med room, just saying. And um, yeah, that, so I think they were still in narcs is exactly what I think. I think they were still in narcs or either narcs or like adamant. Uh, like benzos. Benzos or narcs is exactly what I think they were doing. But you plug it in how it resonates. This is the rehab energy. This is people uh, basically teaming up and forming a plan, formulating a plan to send this person to rehab, whether they want to get sent to rehab or not. Oh my goodness. Let me get a tea leaf. Spirit messages you have for the sign of Sagittarius. A Sagittarius is about to learn of a Scorpio that has HIV soon. A, can, a Cancer for some and for some a Leo. And for some a Libra. Oh my Lord. That's a lot of HIV. Oh my God. Heard a Sag is about to learn of a Cancer for some, a Leo for some, a Libra for some, and a Scorpio for some. That has um, HIV. Oh my God. For some of you guys, it could be one person. For some, it could be two plus people. Um, but there's at least four signs that came out with HIV, Cancer, Scorpio, Libra, Leo. It could be masculine or feminine energies. Um, they could have a Cancer, Scorpio, Leo, Libra, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Node, Moon, Hamer, Jupiter charts. That is a lot of freaking HIV energy. A lot. You plug it in how that resonates. Uh, oh my goodness. For some, it could be one person in your life. For some, it could be four million. You have, you know, because it could be like 400 Scorpios. I mean, I hope not. I hope not. But I'm just using an example. Like 400 Scorpios or two, two Libras or 5,000 Leos. I mean, how that resonates. But at least um, there was at least four signs in there. So you plug it in how it resonates. Chair empty, something, someone is leaving your life, hammock, taking a vacation physically or mentally. Chair empty, someone is leaving your life. For some Sagittarius, there will be a forced termination. For some, you will help with this. For some, a very significant funeral soon. And for some, you're going to learn of a death of an earth sign that's going to be connected to a lawsuit connected to you. Oh my God. Whoa. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh. So, um, so if this resonates with you, 
a termination of somebody at your workplace soon. For some of you guys, you're going to help with the termination. I strongly feel for a lot of you guys, it's this freaking med room incident. And I am so serious. For some, you could work in corporate. Or you could help call corporate and give inf all the information you know with this Pisces. Because this Pisces sounds like they have effed up in a huge way. And I think they've been stealing benzos or narcs or both. And I'm just being for real about that. I'm serious. But you plug it in your life how it resonates. If that resonates for you, that's pretty freaking serious and screwed up. Just saying, saying. Um, but I think you're gonna you're gonna help at least one of you guys. You're gonna help divulge information and cover your ass on this shit. And that's exactly what I would do. Absolutely, cover your own. Um, but yeah, I mean, I believe in teamwork. Absolutely. But do I believe in people stealing narcs from med rooms? No. Do I believe in people stealing benzos from uh, med rooms? No. Absolutely not. Nay, nay. Um, so. That's the four. That's the fourth termination. So I think some of these people they're under contract, especially with the healthcare professionals. They could be under contract, and they're going to be forced to freaking leave. Absolutely. I don't care if you're under contract or not. That's called breach of contract. For um, and they will be terminated. For some, you're going to help terminate them. So I think you're either a manager, boss, CEO, or you're in corporate. However, that resonates. For some, it's a funeral, so a person leaving your life, so they will pass away and you, um, in the funeral energy. For some, um, there's going to be a death of an earth sign soon, and I heard you will be connected to a lawsuit connected to this death. So this death is going to lead to a lawsuit in some shape, form, or fashion um, of an earth sign. Earth signs are Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. They could have Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, Node, Midheaven, or Jupiter. You plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates with you, um, and that's chair empty, someone leaving your life. Now, yeah. Wow. Let me see if I hear anything else. There will be one very significant death. In a healthcare facility soon, too, that's going to lead to a lawsuit. Some, this is your family member. Some, you work at this place. Oh, my Lord. So, for some of you guys, there's going to be a very significant death in a um, healthcare facility place um and um for some it is your family member that is passing away so chair empty the death of them at this healthcare place um and that's the chair empty for you because they will be passing away and that could be the funeral energy for some of you guys too um and for some of you guys you are the one that works at this healthcare place that this person's passing away at and that will be the lawsuit energy you will be connected to i feel so chair empty, the person is passing away, um, which is going to create a lawsuit. So a lot of lawsuit energy in here too. Um, wow, holy moly. Hammock, taking a vacation physically or mentally. A particular Sagittarius is about to undergo so much stress that they're going to take a long staycation. It is much well-deserved. Okay, I heard a particular side is about to undergo so much stress that they're about to take uh, a staycation, a long staycation. It's much well deserved. And absolutely, everybody needs, uh, needs to protect their mental health, physical, mental, spiritual um, health. Absolutely. Um, I heard a long staycation, so I'm thinking like two plus weeks, possibly. That's what I'm thinking, but you plug it in how it resonates. Um, but it's a staycation, so it's... It's like a mental health break. It's like an extended mental health break is what I'm feeling on this. Um, like an extended mental health staycation. And there's nothing wrong with that. Absolutely not. Everybody needs to, a mental health day every now and then. But I think this person is about to take like a mental health week or mental health two weeks. Um, but in all fairness, if this resonates with you and you're having to undergo all this crap, 
So there's some good messages in here. But a lot of this, there's a lot of chaos, a lot of craziness, a lot of shysty co-worker energy, and a lot of lawsuit energy in here. I mean, a lot. So if you were the, if these messages resonate with you, I'd be taking a freaking staycation month if I could. I mean, because this, or I would free willingly quit. That's why I don't like signing contracts because of crap like this. You have, you have because if you get around the wrong coworkers, this is what you, if you sign a contract, and you get around the wrong co-workers, this is the energy that you are in, and you're stuck there. That's why I don't line, like signing contracts at facilities, because of crap like this. And I'm just being for real, for real. And I'm serious. That's why I haven't ever signed a contract when um, I've worked at a healthcare facility, ever, because of things like this. Because I want the free will to be able to leave if I have to because of things like this. I've seen too much in my working days as working as a healthcare professional and I'm serious. Whew. Okay. Let me see if I hear anything else. A Sagittarius is about to meet with a very, very, very important Libra very soon and tell them the truth of things finally some corporate some very high position of high authority judicial system oh my god so you plug it in, how it resonates. I heard a um, Sag is about to meet with a very important high position, high authority. Heard, and then I heard judicial system. So somebody that works in the judicial system in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, and, um, and some of you guys, it's corporate. So some is corporate, some is very high in the judicial system. Um, I'm thinking like a judge energy, a lawyer or a judge energy, uh, possibly. Um, however that resonates, but, and I heard tell them the real truth, finally. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. It's going to cause this Libra to create positive series of chain events for a family. But no, there will be repercussions here. Okay, I heard it's going to cause this Libra. So I think they work in, one of them works in corporate whoever this is for Sag, one of you guys is going to, sounds like one, you're going to talk to somebody in corporate. One, you're going to talk to somebody high up in your judicial system. I think judge or lawyer energy. For some, it could be both. But however that resonates, you're going to tell the truth finally. So you're finally going to tell the truth to somebody. It sounds like you have lied in the past. You're finally going to do it. It's going to create this person to create positive series of chain events for a family. But there will be repercussions. So I think repercussions for you because you lied in the past is what I think. Or repercussions for somebody else. It could be repercussions for this Pisces, possibly. But repercussions for somebody in some shape, form, or fashion. Let me see if I hear anything else. Repercussions for the ones that lied and withheld information. Okay. And caused abuse. Okay. Repercussions for the ones that lied and withheld information and caused abuse. So that, you know, that could be you or somebody you're connected to, but somebody withheld information and lied and withheld information and caused abuse. So whoever those people are, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, somebody did upon a family. Um, but it sounds like at least one of you sides is about to meet with a very high position of high authority in, in the judicial system. I strongly feel it's a judge or a lawyer. Um, but there will have to be repercussions for the people that lied and withheld information and caused abuse. However, that resonates. 
All right. I love you guys. I hope this helped. This was a long but strong one. Love you guys. Namaste.